One of the world's most amazing airports opened on this date in 1939. Today it doesn't seem like a big deal, but in 39, New York's LaGuardia Airport was something entirely new. Named for legendary former New York Mayor Fiorello LaGuardia, the airport at its time was state-of-the-art and even had a terminal for flying boats. It had new ideas on traffic flow, separate levels for departing and incoming flights. It was one of New York's two airports, the other eventually being JFK. One of the East Coast's busiest, but about 20 years ago it became famous as being obsolete and dirty. Rising to the criticisms, the Port Authority started a multi-billion dollar redo which will be finished in about three years. LaGuardia became best known as the takeoff airport for the so-called miracle on the Hudson, crippled by birds. But birds are so common at LaGuardia, they are almost always on the airport's weather radio. LaGuardia Airport ATS Information Romeo, use caution for numerous birds in the vicinity of LaGuardia Airport, use caution. I hope pilots are able to hear that warning a little bit better than we could. Today, LaGuardia has flights that go all over the nation. On a personal note, I once flew into LaGuardia, but during the cab ride to downtown, I thought I was with Clara Peller and her friends in that classic Wendy's commercial. I'm Dennis Daly.